Hello everyone, welcome to another video of Mames and Sense. So what I'm gonna be uh, showing you today is how to downgrade pipe, which um, in the last months or years has been made very simple because it used to be with like PowerShell windows and stuff. But now that um, people are f finding new ways to code stuff, then that's also getting easier. So now it's been made very, very simple. So this is only gonna take you about a minute at max. So to get this, you need to, to so first you need this doc. So to get this, to go to this doc, uh, I will leave a link in the description below for this document. And um, after that, you will need a depot downloader. So I will just uh, quickly download this to show you guys. As you can see, just uh, press extract files. Okay. And then you go back here. And then th this is explanatory. This is very explanatory. So then you just uh, go here and then double click on this. And that, that will, that's everything you need to do for that. So then you press your Windows key on your keyboard. So Windows key, you hold that down and then press R. So you, you're holding down Windows and pressing R at the same time. And it will open up this, which you will uh, then type in this, which I will also leave in the description below. And you press OK or Enter. And uh, you will see everything here. And after this, I will also leave this in the description below. Uh, you just copy this, Control C it or right click and copy and then go back to your steam console paste this in i'm not going to do it because i already have it installed but once you've done that you just press enter and you're done like that's everything you need to do to downgrade pipe so once that's done then this will come up in your uh, so you will go to your local uh, disk program files uh, times 86 uh, then you will look for steam uh, then you go steam apps content and then here here and then you will have all of this so if you want to install mods you can check out my other videos that will uh, have a tutorial on how to install maps i'll also show you how to install the unity mod manager which is a very essential thing and that's basically everything for me so guys everything is in the description have fun modding i'll see you next time